एडिशन थीरम ऑन प्रॉबेबिलिटी एडिशन थीरम ऑन प्रॉबेबिलिटी देन स्टेटमेंट ऑफ एडिशन थीरम इफ कैपिटल ए का मा कैपिटल बी बेनी टू इवेंट्स इफ कैपिटल ए का मा कैपिटल बी बेनी टू इवेंट्स इन ए सैंपल स्पेस यस बी एनी टू इवेंट्स इन ए सैंपल स्पेस यस देन पी ऑफ ए यूनियन बी इज इक्वल टू P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B. If A comma B are any two events in a sample space, yes, then P of A union B is equal to P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B. Then it's a proof. Case one. If A intersection B is equal to If a intersection B is equal to pi, draw the diagram for a intersection B is an empty set. A intersection B is an empty set. If a intersection B is equal to pi, that implies probability of empty set. Probability of empty set is equal to zero. Probability of empty set is equal to zero. By definition of probability, p of a union b is equal to p of a plus p of b. It can be written as p of a plus p of b minus zero. p of a plus p of b minus zero is equal to p of a plus p of b minus p of a intersection b. Therefore, P of A union B is equal to P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B. Is the first case of addition theorem. Is the first case of addition theorem. And next to go to case two. Case two. A intersection B is not equal to phi. A intersection B is not equal to phi. Draw the diagram. If A comma B are two sets, then their common part is represented as A intersection B, and this one represented as A minus B, and this one represented as B minus C. This one depends as B minus C. From figure, A can be written as A is equal to A minus B union A intersection B. A minus B union A intersection B, and A minus B intersection. A intersection B is equal to pi. A minus B intersection A intersection B is equal to pi. That implies P of A is equal to P of A minus B union A intersection B. P of A minus B union A intersection B is equal to P of A minus B plus P of A intersection B. Therefore, P of A minus B is equal to P of A minus of P of A intersection B. This is the first condition. Here, let us consider A intersection B not equal to phi. Then A can be written as A minus B union A intersection B, and A minus B and A minus B intersection A intersection B. And a minus b intersection a intersection b is equal to phi. Then p of a is equal to p of a minus b union a intersection b. 
this is, it can be written as p of a minus b plus p of a intersection b. Therefore, p of a minus b is equal to p of a minus of p of a intersection b. And next one, from figure a union b can be written as, here a union b, a union b can be written as a minus b union b. And a minus b intersection b is equal to 5 a minus b intersection b is equal to 5 plus p of a union b is equal to p of a minus b union b p of a minus b union b is equal to p of a minus b plus p of b p of a minus b plus p of b from condition 1 p of a minus b from condition 1, P of A minus B can be written as P of A minus P of A intersection B. It is equal to P of A minus P of A intersection B plus P of B. It is equal to P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B. Therefore, P of A union B is equal to P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B. P of A union B is equal to P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B.